Many of us use BlueStacks. BlueStacks is free to download and also it's free to use, but they're true for a certain period of time. After that, it forces us to either pay for the premium version or install some of the apps. In this video, I'll be telling you a funny and simple trick to how to use BlueStacks without paying or without installing any kind of apps. So without further delay, let's get started. So I'm recording my laptop screen. Uh, you need to open the BlueStacks app, and it's now opening. And before opening the BlueStacks app, make sure your Ethernet connection is off. Uh, as you can see, I'm on a Wi-Fi connection. It's off now. Whatever Ethernet connection do you have, disconnect it before opening the app. Now you need to go to the settings, then to apps. There you'll find the app app synchronize. You need to clear the cache, clear data, all kinds of data you have to clear them. And finally, hit the disable button and uninstall all kinds of updates. So all kinds of updates of this particular app is uninstalled from my PC. Now you need to disable the app and force stop it. And then go to back, you will find that the app sync app is not there anywhere. Uh, neither on the SD card, neither in the download section. So now you need to go to your desired app, the online app you want to open. I open the Play Store, and as you can see, as it is offline, it's showing that there is no internet connection. After that, you need to switch the internet back on. As soon as you switch it on, this pop up comes up. You need to press the Try Another App button, and a new window opens like this. You can see, you need to close that window. Now this is the main trick you need to do, you need to simply close the new window which opens up. As you can see the play store is back to off online, you can download whatever apps you want to. Uh, for example, uh, I will download whatsapp messenger. Now as soon as I install, try to install the app, this pop up window comes up again. Now you need to again press the try another app button and close the window. Now this uh, pop up will come up whenever BlueStacks tries to uh, connect to the internet. So all you need to do is whenever the pop up comes up, you need to press the try another app button and close the window. Now this will occur one or two or three, a maximum of four times or five times and after that it will stop automatically. Now another thing you need to remember that before opening any kind of online app, you need to disconnect the internet connection. Now after opening the app, you need to switch on the internet back again. While doing so, the pop-up will come up again. Now the same trick works again. Press the try another app button and close the window as soon as it opens up. As you can see, it opened up again. Now the same trick works again. As I already said that this will occur a uh, maximum of 4 to 5 times and after that it will stop automatically. So as you can see it's working fully. Now suppose in Clash of Clans I try to connect to the Google Play games from the settings that pop up comes up again. So the same trick, press the try another uh, button and close the window. So now I will connect to one of my accounts. The pop up comes up again and you need to repeat the trick. Maybe it's annoying but it's very easy and it works fully. So in this way you can use any kind of online apps in BlueStacks without paying or without installing any of their sponsored apps. So this was all for the video. Hope you have found the video helpful and if you have found it helpful please give a thumbs up and if you are new hit the subscribe button and support me. So thank you for watching. See you in my next video.